I fooled you, you thought I was. I am showcasing, what are these? The thimbles, but they're not priced. The old spools, if you will. You're in an antique store and you're in Jim and Gina section. Step on in, step on in, the water's warm. Uh, we have a lot to show you guys. Um, this is always the time of day and for some odd reason the room where all the dogs pack in here and they wrestle. They like to do that. I don't know. Okay, you guys, a lot of this I've highlighted before, so I might not get into deep detail of something that's been here for several shows. I'm going to really profile the, the new items, but I can't overlook this because I do like this. I don't know why it's still there. Peekaboo. Look at that typewriter, you guys. How cute is that? $125 from 1957. Vintage typewriter. The rattan stools. They are back in the house. They are $48 each. She did lower them substantially. We have a great um, vintage travel case for shoes, whatever. We do have the key, the original key, $98 on that. I believe that's crocodile, alligator. Something, one of the two. Okay, uh, blue glass, more of the stools. These will be great if you have a bar. Um, they're great tall bar stools. Those are very fun. Um, the primitive dough bowl, 128. Okay, remember how I showed you in Janet's section or Janice's section? <laughs> one of you change your names. Janice's section, she had the tall display case. Uh, well, here's the mini version, uh, $265. It is amazing. Curio cabinet or the butler's cabinet as we call it. She always puts a little knickknacks in there. Brought in a great plow. This is great for yard art. Okay. So we've got this one. And if you guys go near, if you're heading, like there's the carriage house and then there's the chicken coop and you can kind of look over and see the chickens right there in front of you along that fence line is a bunch of rusty yard art. It's like under everything is under $30. So we have a bunch of stuff over there, plows and wheels and all kinds of things. So ask me, take a picture, come back to the barn, say how much for this and I'll give you a price. That's how I'm rolling this show. Okay, we're looking at a vintage toolbox, uh, blue painted, 50, 42, four, $42. <laughs> the tag was doing this. Okay, I'm very, 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 very excited about a couple things, specifically this. Oh, and the ladder, but the ladder's not priced. The ladder came in. Watering cans, watering cans are us. We got a lot of those to show with some great flowers. The chair of 38. Okay, but this is what I want to talk to you about. It is teak. Teak is a great wood, okay? It is painted. It is a porch swing with a solid brass hardware. You guys look at the original hardware on there, $298. So if you're like, oh, I can't really envision it. I can't picture how it would look. Well, here's what you do. You stand by the carriage house and you look over near the chicken coop and you're gonna see a ginormous oak tree and you're gonna see a white teak bench replica of this swinging from our tree. So you can get an idea how that would look, you guys. People love it, it's great for kids, it's great for having a mint julep, kissing under the sunset, whatever you wanna do. Get one of those, it's fabulous, this is gonna go fast. And it's worth every penny. The Derby Farms crate, $28 on that. The Vintage Doll Cradle, $15. Again, looking for some dolls to fill your doll paraphernalia? Contact me. I have mine in storage in a bag. They're all sleeping. Some great little tractors here. Toy tractors, $28 on those. This is incredible. You put your candles there. I love the rest on it. Vintage Chippy Plant Stand, $48 on that. Okay. Roxy found a little crevice. There she is. She's like, this area has not been dusted. So she's going to hang out there for a little bit. Uh, Choo Chi's confused, doesn't like her doing that. $125 on this 1930s United Desk LA. It uh, has the panel on the back, all original, leather, wood, swivel, on wheels. Um, so if you need to like wheel from one end of the office to another, like get something out of that fax machine, you know, like we do all the time, that's what you need. Okay, flipping on over here, my producer's like, what's a fax? I'm just kidding. You know what a fax is. Okay, uh, $16 on the biscuit tins over here. We've got a few of them, $8 on these. These sold like hotcakes last show. People love those great collectibles. We've got, this is great for camping. Don't get the new ones but from Costco. Get the old ones, the, the, the ones that are aluminum. Those are incredible. And then we have the, um, the firkin basket. I remember the first time I thought that I said that, I, I thought I was cursing, but I'm not cursing. It is a firkin basket. Um, Okay, uh, people do collect those, those are great. The tins here, coming on over here, the spice rack, more um, biscuit tins over here. I don't think she's done, she might be bringing in more things. She kind of pops in here uh, and I see her car and then she's in and out, so we'll see. Um, but this is one of her showstoppers. Vintage shabby tall dresser with the adorable brass handles, you guys, come on in here. 
Get a close up on that macro, those handles there. 148 on those. Aren't those adorable? Look at this piece, aged gracefully, as I like to say. A little um, rabbits for $12, a nod to Easter, if you will, along with the pink little um, lamps, which would be so cute in like a bathroom or uh, it's vintage pair of bedside table lamps, $98 for the set, you guys. That's a steal. Coming on over here, speaking of Easter colors, this is really fun. The vintage uh, California Pottery seven piece dip bowl set for $38 there. I wanna do a, a quick pan here. Um, no way. This is vintage fresh, uh, the French towel rack. $32 on that. Look at that, you guys. All in French. Incredible. She's got some great stuff this show. Okay, the crock, the crock pot. Hey, don't ever end the, underestimate the power of the crock pot, right? We, my mom used to do that week in review. She'd throw everything from the whole week in a crock pot, and we'd all eat it on Sunday. <laughs> Kid you not. Week in review. It was a big stew of sorts. Don't get the crock pot. <laughs> Your kids will have flashbacks 46 years later. Just kidding, get in the crock pot. Okay, the owl, come on over here. Come on, who, who, who's your daddy? I am, okay, $248 over here. The concrete garden owl with the pedestal uh, weighs a lot, weighs a lot. So someone saw this on social media and said, hey, I want the owl, but I don't want the pedestal. I'm sorry, you buy the owl, the pedestal's free. Buy the pedestal, the owl is free. So same thing, $248, you get them both, okay? This is adorable. I love this. We're only looking at $15 for this cute little guy. Chalkware? Let me see. Yeah, he's chalkware. He's not super heavy. Okay. Uh, they are a pair. They look like um, children growing up way, way too fast. <laughs> the top hat and whatnot, but that's okay. Um, $128 on the vintage bird bath. I love that. More little Easter scenes here. We have the uh, vintage concrete duck for 68, the little concrete bunny here for 38, and we've got our pedestals here for 65 and 68 um, on both of those. Okay. I know it's your dinner time. It's your dinner time. Come on over here. Fan, vintage, blue, love it. We've got some fun little things in here. Uh, cute little uh, jewelry box. <gasps> There's a ring in there. There's not six dollars. I get you guys every time, don't I? Um, it's my acting skills. Okay, the little kitty cat bookends. Uh, Thirty-six dollars. This says as found. I don't know what that means. There might be a little chip or something. My team is so transparent, so sometimes it's even hard to find the flaw. Great stand. This came in. Uh, we're looking at the three-tiered oak shelf for one hundred and forty-five dollars. Flip on over here. We've got some great. Um, the ice bucket for thirty-eight. We actually have a couple ice buckets and champagne buckets to show. Couple in here, couple in Janet's section, so take your pick. The egg basket, $28 over here. I can't get through the section, this whole session without pointing out my directional balls. <laughs> Love it, $125 on those. Come on over here, churn your uh, butter for $198. This is fabulous, you guys, people love those. The antique gentleman's dresser with the pin cove, uh, the little dovetailing, dates back to 1880s, $248. I want you to get the detailed carb work up here, the mirror, all of that. Fabulous piece, fabulous piece, you guys. Okay, the vintage little jars over here, $18 with the lid. It's great, it's tilted. Put your hand in there and grab your Hershey Kiss or whatever you need to get. Okay, this just came in as did that. These, <laughs> that was not a toot, that was a moan. Oh, look. This is some of her best work. Some of her best work. She can't go anywhere, but I'm very impressed. Ah, ah. <laughs> She's like the great Houdini of dogs. The antique, uh, the inlaid game table with the uh, chessboard. It measures 30 by 30. It does tilt down. Fabulous piece. So you know what I do this? I don't play chess. I don't play checkers. Full disclosure. But you know what I do? I love grids. I love numbers. I love anything like that. Um, typography. I, this is awesome. Just how she has it like that. It's $198. Fabulous piece. That's great. Okay. Vintage wood metal garden arch door, $228. It is large. It measures 74 and a half by 30. That's going to go very, very fast. It looks like it came out of an old, um, estate or a church perhaps. I want you to look at the age on that. You guys, that's incredible. Some great, um, antique fence, uh, fennials for garden decor, $48 on those. Uh, those would be great toppers. Again, your hardware, it looks like they brought in more. Oh, oh, the chess pieces. Get them both. $48 on the whole set. And then get the, t the table, right? There you go. 
There you go. I love it. I love it. Okay, you guys, um, moving on over here, the locker, one of my favorite things in the barn, still here. Not sure why you guys haven't gotten it, but it is here and it is 72 uh, by 18 deep by 24, $198 on that. And I love the number on that. The mid-century drafting table chair, uh, we're looking at 78 or $75 on that. Flipping on over here, some of these items are still here from the past show, so I'm not gonna get into that too much. But if you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, just come to the barn. Just come to the barn. Don't don't tease me by calling me and saying I want I just come. Meet me. Say I want that. And I'm so excited to be at Brick and Barn this Friday, Saturday, Sunday from 9 to 5. Be there.